Ohio, Ohio, Ohio. You sly dogs, man. You sly dogs, man. <laughs> I swear, man. Literally could not be timed any better. Three years have gone by. And to be fair, it did go up from 120 when it came out. But can you believe this? Week of the Withering Waves drop. Literally comes out tomorrow. And look what we have here. First thing we see, increased original resin cap. Took long enough. Very interesting timing. <laughs> Optimized artifact custom configurations as well. This sounds like the things we've been asking for. Huh. This is weird. Why all of a sudden it seems? <laughs> no, but seriously. Great news, but I just can't help but laugh with the timing of it. You know, it's just like, <laughs> I saw this and I was like, are you serious? Also, I didn't even think this was going to be happening today. I didn't think we were going to get a, a dev discussion. Let's read through it. It's exciting news, but like I said, I just I couldn't help but 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 giggle at the, <laughs> the timing of it. So increased original resin cap, uh, optimized artifact custom configurations. Dear traveler, the latest development. No, sorry, the latest developers discussion has arrived. Today we'll be introducing optimizations that will be released in version 4.7. To improve your gaming, your gaming experience, we've raised multiple caps and up to updated existing systems. I can't talk. Let's check them out. So. Oh, okay. I was going to say, I thought it was going to be like 240, like Star Rail. I guess that was, I was a little too excited. Starting in version 4.7, the cap of original resin will be increased to 200. Wait, Pymons? <laughs> that sounds like something that the comments would say. Yay, we can craft five resin at once. Oh my gosh. No, it's seriously though. Like it's it's great. It's great. I, I, like I said, I, it's just it's just funny with the timing. Increased in enhancement materials and food cap. Wait, are you serious? An inventory limit for weapon enhancement materials to 9,999. I've actually heard that already from somewhere. I think in, in our Discord, we talked about that already. But that's insane. And then the food is, is a, wait. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, I'm dumb. It was already that. And now it's going to go up to almost 100K? I don't even know how people get that far in the weapon enhancement. I understand how you, you just don't level your weapons and stuff like that, but wow. I mean, I've never even gotten close to, to 10,000. So that's crazy though. That's awesome. That's another pog change. Likewise limits for forging ores, character XP materials. Ooh, an enhancement or artifact enhancement materials will also be increased in new version. Limit for ingredients will be increased from 2,000 to, to about 10,000 to prevent situations where players have to destroy excess materials after obtaining a large quantity. You know, just reading this stuff, it reminds me of a comment that somebody posted on one of my posts. And I'm not trying to gas them, but he said if Genshin wanted to, they could make it where there's no competition. And like I said, I'm not trying to gas them up, but like, if they just listen to their fan base more often and we got these things like sooner and they would do it like, like i said more often i mean i don't really have to finish that sentence increase friendship cap uh from you go to 100 friends now i think it was like 60 currently i don't know i don't, I don't have any i barely have like 30 friends on my friends list but you can go up to 100 now okay so it's been increased again all right, so we've gotten here before and we've been disappointed. So let's see what they went back to do. We talked about how they put this system together and it was a good start because now you have this in effect. Now you can tweak it to make it good. So here's where we are. They have the system in play. Now let's see what they've done to configure it. Since the fast equipped artifacts feature was launched, the developers have been paying close attention to your feedback. Oh, really? And experience the optimization to this feature accordingly. 
to help you quickly and conveniently assemble a set of artifacts starting from version 4.7, the recommended stats feature will be added to fast equip custom configuration. This feature will automatically fill in the recommended sets and attributes based on data from active players in the game. Okay, now reading that, let's see what this looks, looks like here. Recommended stats. Uh, no, still didn't fix it. <laughs> no, that's not it. That's still not it. That's still not it. It's just recommended stats, basically. Okay, so still not it. Still possible. They could do it right, but that's not that's not what we were thinking. That's all, folks. All right, let's like like a look at the comments. It's been 84 years. Uh, no 120 FPS yet. Overcap the resin, increase resin. Means nothing when the regenerate is the same. <laughs> Actually, yeah, that, that is the same. All right. You know, hey, people are happy with the change for the most part. You guys are really afraid of weathering waves. Like I said, we always talked about this. They just need somebody else to kind of put the pressure on them. And you can see, you know, maybe these things were planned already and it has nothing to do with weathering waves. But just playing devil's advocate. Hey, it, it seems like it, right? You know, this game is releasing and now all of a sudden we're getting all these different things. There's like this animated short coming out with the travelers, you know, and like I said, that's its own thing, most likely. But this kind of thing, you know, like, I mean, it's just, it's good to have that pressure on you. It's good to have, like, if somebody's at the top of the mountain and there's just no other threat, they can just put their hands back, kick their feet up and relax, you know. But once you have somebody who's kind of climbing that mountain, kind of getting up close to you, you know, you might have to be like, you know, look down on them a little bit and be like, hold up, you know, let me just do a little bit of this, a little bit of that, because they know if they do do those things, people will be satisfied, you know, and don't get me wrong. I'm excited for weathering waves. I'm ready for it. And I just didn't really see something like this coming. I thought they would definitely like try and be a little generous or not generous but they would make some changes that would appeal to the audience in some way shape or form but i was expecting that in natlan i wasn't expecting that now i was thinking like you know hey natlan will be a big change or something you know maybe like they'll do something like this in natlan but no right here right now you know emerge so that's the news. What do you guys think about this in the comments? Do you think this is happening because of other things releasing? Do you think this is happening just because it was going to happen anyways? Let me know in the comments. But uh, yeah, 4.7 is looking to be pretty juicy. Pretty juicy. But that'll be all for me. Hope you guys have a good time uh, playing Weathering Waves in a couple days. Hope you guys just have a good time in general. Good luck to you all. And I will catch you guys in the next one.